Eddie Cardi. This is episode nine of Seatbelt Sessions, and this week we're joined by Fenberg. Do you want to introduce yourself to us? Yeah, hi, I'm Fenberg. Uh, I'm from Swansea, and yeah, I make like indie pop kind of music. Hi, I'm Fenberg. This is my song, Unlearn. I got so awful lonely down here on earth. But you twist me and you turn me, come of age rebirth. Pinky swear for get me nice. What first made you kind of want to venture into playing? Um, so I started learning guitar when I was like seven um, and I would always just kind of play like Avril Lavigne and then I got bored of it so <laughs> I started to kind of like write my own stuff when I was sort of about 13 and then I was uh, like a very nervous kid so it was mostly just recording it all but uh, yeah I, I want to definitely like now that Covid's over well ending um, it'd be nice to like start playing live and stuff yeah yes definitely I can't convince myself I can't convince myself My future's looking pretty bleak How can I unlearn what the past has proven to me? So how long have you been performing as Fenberg? Um, like the last year and a half So yeah, not, not a super long time but uh yeah, yeah, it's exciting. Yeah, definitely. So you said that you're looking forward now, hopefully we're seeing the back of mm -hmm. D. Um, that you're looking forward to doing some performing. Mm -hmm. Have you done any performing before as Fenberg? Uh, no, everything I've done up until now has kind of just been like acoustic open mic, um, but I'm working on like getting a live band together uh, so that we can work up to doing that. Yeah, Wicked. exciting. You trust me, you can tell me I'm across the bed. It's science, my reliance drains towns away. Bridges tall and rivers wide don't even need to say goodbye. Mm -hmm. I guess you've had to just build up your audience mm -hmm. online. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. how has that been for you? Uh, yeah, it's been really good. I, I've had a really good reception uh, from both uh, back in Swansea and in Cardiff. Um, and yeah, it's it's very exciting. Whereas when I was like 14 and writing stuff that was absolute rubbish, and I was like, why is no one paying attention? I was like, it's because it wasn't good. And now I'm actually making stuff that's pretty good, <laughs> and I'm getting a good reception. And yeah. it's yeah, it's really great. My future's looking pretty. like listening to a lot of both like really like straight to the point like explosive pop music and sort of kind of like emo music so I was really used to the production of both um, but I really loved like the song structure of the really basic song structure of a, of a pop song um, so it's nice to like have like the pop structure and then kind of play around with production and style and everything on top of it yeah, um, yeah. cool Girl, no one could ever bear. My future's looking pretty bleak How can I unlearn what the past has proven to me? And one day you'll figure you should leave How can I unlearn what is so Okay, we're back with Glove Songs, round nine, this week with Fenberg. Okay, so I want you to pop your hand in the bag, blind pick an album, pass it to me, and I'll give you 30 seconds to name as many songs on that album as you possibly can. All right. Okay, you ready? Yeah. In you go. Oops. Sorry, hold the bag a bit weird. Okay, we've got God's Favourite Customer by Father John Misty. 
Okay. Do you know the album? This is the only album of his I haven't listened to. <laughs> that is typical. <laughs> it's, it's, it's his most recent album. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's an interesting one. Mm -hmm. So we'll give it a go anyway. Oh God, okay. Um, all I'm going to say is pay attention to the name of the album, okay? I didn't hear the name of it. <laughs> the album's called God's Favourite Customer, okay? okay? Alright. I will give you 30 seconds starting now. God's Favourite Customer? God's Favourite Customer is on the list. <laughs> I think that's all. Just chuck some out there. Just um, chuck some out there. Random song names. I'll list some of his other songs. We've yeah, got sure. Real Love Baby. Real Love uh, Baby's not Nancy on there. From now on. No. <laughs> uh, the Ideal Husband. No. This is a nightmare <laughs> because they're all from different. Yeah, you know I all know. the other ones. <laughs> You've got seven seconds yeah. left. I don't, I don't think it's, I don't think Do you know his real name? Oh, it's Josh yeah. Tillman and Mr. Tillman yeah. was a track. <laughs> you could have had, hang out in the gallows, Mr. Tillman, just dumb enough to try date night, please don't die the palace. We go on. My future's looking pretty, pretty. 